And now to Luxembourg-based David Danisa produced and co-directed the movie Chameleon, which was shot in Nigeria, Antwerp and Luxembourg. It speaks to us about the movie. Tales of some of the illegal activities surrounding oil explorations in Nigeria is the plot of a new Nollywood movie titled Chameleon. Produced and co-directed by Luxembourg-based Nigerian financial expert David Danisa, the movie was shot mostly in the central European state with additional scenes from Antwerp and Lagos. What we tried to do was to bring up some salient issues surrounding uh, the trade in uh, stolen Nigerian petro um, petroleum um, in exchange for weapons that are illegally shipped to Nigeria. That is basically the plot. Chameleon tells the story of two antagonistic and ruthless characters, one originating from Luxembourg and the other a Nigerian spy. In the lead is Denisa, who played the Nigerian agent, determined to uncover illegal activities in the West, while opposite him is Lucio, played by European supermodel and actor Michel Farage, whose mission is to protect European business interests in Africa. The movie, which was written by Denisa, is inspired by his experience as a journalist in Nigeria, during which he reported financial markets along Nigerian coastal cities. He tries to set foot in Europe. You send in your best man to go undercover to investigate. Follow his trip through What I found out was that, um, as far as Nigeria is concerned, we seem to have two two segments of what we call the national economy. We have a segment that's um, comprehensively linked to the international markets, and we have the local economy. The one affects the other. The big one affects the little one more negatively. So the impact of uh, petroleum activity on communities in the creeks um, has sort of giving way to um, developments that are totally uh, um, not positive for the people. We talk of um, um, transactions in illegal petroleum. You'll find out that the local communities have been, um, they, they've sort of gravitated towards uh, becoming players in the industry. And um, the effect has been quite destructive. The money coming in is used to fund militancy, is used to fund inter-ethnic clashes, and the people providing, the people enabling this uh, unwholesome tendency, um, we have some foreigners involved. And I would even say that some of the developed states that are supposed to have some measure of control over their boundaries, their, their, their borders, they have been, should I say, complicit by not acting um, effectively to check the outflow of illegal weapons from their societies. Although Chameleon employed European cast and crew members, Denisa insists his movie is a Nigerian film primarily created for the Nigerian audience. I would say essentially my target audience are Nigerians. But that said, um, there are also people in European communities that are, that, that are interested in what goes on. Because um, out there, you'll discover that um, state policies are not fully explained to the people. There is some kind of disconnect. So it's to raise the awareness that there are some things going on out there that your state is involved in. And in producing this movie, I collaborated with, uh, with a lot of guilds there in, in Luxembourg, in France. Uh, they were happy to participate in the movie. Um, Africans also, Africans in diaspora from other countries and also from the Pacific, the Caribbean and Latin America, they were, they were quite 
forthcoming. They wanted to know what the issues were. I discovered that there are a, lot, there are a whole lot of people interested in Nigeria, Africans, non-Africans alike. They want to understand what the problems are. They want to know why they are, they, we have militants in the Niger Delta. Um, and they want to be critically aware, not just uh, in terms of what they read in the newspaper or how it's presented in the entertainment industry. And that's why we went um, the extra length of you know, really presenting in the time we had available to us the intricacies, the complexities of uh, what we're talking about. Chameleon is scheduled for a Nigerian and European premiere later this year.